Since the dawn of man, scientists have longed to travel through time. In the late 1960s, a crack team of geniuses combined their talents to attempt to break the time barrier. In the Florida Keys, Dr. Woodstock P. Havens was given the task of building a special space shuttle. Yeah, but I decided to make a submarine instead, man. So come on and join me as we float through time. Uncle Woody, like, way back in time. <laughs> I've met some groovy prophets, man. <laughs> oh. What's up, handsome? Say hello to the kids, handsome. <laughs> All right, give me that remote. We'll bring Uncle Woody back to the future. Here goes nothing. Oh. All right. It worked! Time travel alert. Time travel alert. We have a time travel visitor in three, two, one. That's not Uncle Woody! Uncle Woody, man, did I turn you into cloth, man? Handsome, what happened? Handsome, well, oh, what? Oh, this is a judge's robe? Okay, so I have to input a more accurate description. Okay, uh, groovy pants. Uh, far out glasses, colorful clothes. Is that a good description, you think? All right, Uncle Woody, back to the future, part two. All right, this time it's got to work. Time travel alert. Time travel alert. We have a time travel visitor in three, two, one. What? Booga, 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 kangaloosh. Whoa, dude, you're not Uncle Woodstock. I'm not? No. No, I'm not. I am Ambassador Novoto from Planet Jerusalem. What? Pleased to meet you. Oh, uh, yeah. What is an Uncle Woodstock? Well, he's the dude that built this totally beautiful submarine, the Love Sub. I am loving Whoa. this totally beautiful submarine, the Love Sub. <laughs> Thank you. Nice to meet you, Uncle Woodstock. Oh, no, dude, I'm not Uncle Woodstock. I'm his nephew, Shiloh. Nice to meet you. Yeah. <laughs> okay, Bible story time. What? Bible story time. Every time I am coming on board the Skylab Omega, the Commander Cosmos reads me beautiful stories from the Bible, which is called God's Word. Oh, well, I don't know who a Commander Cosmos is, but I could show you the power source. All right. <laughs> Wait. Why don't you get it? It's in that porthole right there. Okie dokie. <laughs> Aren't you <choky? laughs> It's a froggy. Oh. Hello, Kermit. See you later. Bye-bye. Whoa. Wait a minute, dude. It's supposed to squirt you. Ah, <laughs> <dude>. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. It's in that one right over okay. there. Okay. <laughs> right. Wow, that's what I call power. Yeah, man. It's so groovy. Oh. It's more than groovy. It's Nito Burrito. Whoa, dude, I wish I said that. Oh, but dude, look what I found. It's the book of Micah. Micah? I love Micah. I have that on my kitchen counters. Oh, no, dude, that's for Micah. Oh, no, it's not just for Micah. It's for everyone. I mean, why should Micah be the only one with kitchen counters? Okay, dude, you're making my brain hurt. All right, so Micah was like a prophet.
prophet, and God told Micah that God was like the totally most powerful judge in a courtroom. Wow. And God had a case against the people. Well, if God has a case, I'll have a case too. A case of chocolate to you. It's my favorite. No, dude. Like, I don't mean like a case of chocolate milk. I mean a case in court where God said the people were guilty. Oh. Now, let me read you what Micah's message from God. Okay. I will totally destroy you because Ooh. you have sinned so much. The dream police, they come for me. Oh, my yeah, head. Dude. The no, dream it's not the dream police. That's just the warning lights. Ambassador Tofu, come on out, man. There's nobody here but us froggies. Uh, you who? Oh. You who is it? Uh, it's the Yoo-Hoo Man. The Yoo-Hoo Man. Oh, do you have my chocolate? You? Oh, you tricked me. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? If you're going to set off a bunch of alarms, you should give a guy a warning. Well, that is the warning, and that <laughs> is the warning that God gave to Micah. I will destroy you. If I had a choice, I would not want to be destroyed. Well, you do have a choice, dude. I do. Yeah, man. Totally. <laughs> Uh, and there are the choice lines. Oh, you have the coolest toys. <laughs> yeah, man. Go ahead, read the choice, dude. Oh, he has showed you, oh man, what is good. And what does the Lord require of you? To act justly, to love oh, mercy, man. and to walk humbly with your God. Oh, I totally want to do that. Well, you totally do, man. God will give you his promise if you do. Yeah. Uh, Micah said this about God. Mm -hmm. You will. Ooh. Oh, we got to search for it. Oh, are we first. Yeah, okay. I was gonna cheat. All right. All right. Let's look around. The oh, shark. Oh, is it shark? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, there it is. <laughs> okay. All right. You will again have compassion on us. You will tread our sins underfoot and hurl all our iniquities into the depths of the sea. Oh, iniquities. <laughs> I hate iniquities. Oh, they are patooey. They are such nasty, nasty things, those iniquities. Yeah. Yeah, what is an iniquity? Oh, an iniquity is like another word for sin. It's when we do wrong in the eyes of God. Guilty. I am guilty. No, you hoover, no photo. Yeah, totally, man. We're all guilty, but God promised a way to make, to make a way to forgive us. Oh, well, that's groovy. <laughs> yeah. Is that when he is going to stomp on our iniquities and toss them into the sea? Yeah, man. It's Nita Burrito. Oh, I wish I had said that. You did, dude. <laughs> oh, I did. Well, what are we waiting for? Why don't we just act justly, love mercy, and walk humbly with our God? Man, I'm totally down with that. <laughs> oh, don't get down. Get back up again. No, I mean, I can dig it. Do you need a shovel? Okay, no, dude. Well, well, let's just make the choices that God expects us to make and find Uncle Woodstock. Oh, I hope Uncle Woodstock has some chocolate in you who for no photo. Well, we'll see, man. But in the meantime, keep walking with the Lord. And remember what my Uncle Woodstock always says, no matter where you are in time, God is good all the time. Oh, all right, stay righteous, little dude. Need uh, no yeah. See you later. Let's get out of here, man. Out of here. Oh, don't forget oh, your robe. You might need this. <laughs>